Yo, what's up guys? Cloud Watcher here, back with another video. I know, I have not been on YouTube in nearly two weeks, and that's because I never thought of any good video ideas, but today I do. So, in the past, I've made a few videos where I've unscrewed my ceiling fan blades, but you guys might be thinking, how are they all on today? And here's how I'll do it. So, if you want to unscrew your ceiling fan blades, here are the steps. Step one, buy a screwdriver. I'm using this but you can use any screwdriver that can fit in the bolts. And step two, on the very inner end of the ceiling fan blade, there are bolts. And you stick your screwdriver in and just do lucky loosey, righty tighty. This will take some time. Then when the screws get really loose, just be extra careful because if you lose that screw, there's no way in getting your ceiling fan blade back on. So put your bolts in a very safe place, like it's crucial that you know where they are. There's one. There you go. And now the ceiling fan blades are off. I just put the blade on the ground. And there you go. You have unscrewed your ceiling fan blade. And how you get it back on? Here are the steps. I recommend putting one of the bolts in the ceiling fan blade holes before you do it, as you see here. I mean, what you want to do is line up the bolt holes of the blade to the fan and just fit the screw in there and just righty tighty. So it's basically just reversing the steps you did to take them off. I'm gonna assume you guys know what to do for the other bolt. Now, you guys might be thinking, should I try this at home? And my answer is, sure, it's not that dangerous. It's especially way less dangerous than spraying cooking spray through a lighter, which I recommend not doing, because it can easily go downhill. But here are some things you need to take if you do do it. If you unscrew your ceiling fan blades, there's going to be an imbalance in your ceiling fan, and it could blow a fuse, which is what happened in one of the rooms in my house about a year and a half ago, and it could cause your ceiling fan to fall, so just watch how wobbly it gets if you turn on the fan with the missing blades. And if it gets to be too wobbly, then just turn it off. And... If you think that you'll lose the bolts, don't do it. And if you're a mom watching your little kids' videos, please tell them not to do it because I highly doubt they'll know what you're doing. So little kids, don't do it. And if your mom is watching it, little kids' mom, please tell them not to do it. See ya! 